find a place to relax and enjoy some inner stillness. You may close your eyes while lying down or you may sit in a comfortable spot. You could also have this on in the background while doing something creative like painting or cooking. Even if you tune out for a while, don't worry, your subconscious mind hears everything. As I guide you through this process, let my voice be your voice. And through this voice, we're going to honour the planet Jupiter and we're going to heal and increase the starlight of Jupiter that comes through you. Are you ready? Then let's begin. I am wise. I am wise because I know I don't know everything. It's the great unknown that keeps me going. I am motivated to discover more, to learn more, to experience more. My knowledge is constantly expanding. I know that on this earth plane, the concept of absolute does not exist. Nothing here is perfect and nothing here lasts forever. All is in flux. All is in motion. All is in perpetual change. All people are my teachers. And any environment provides fodder for enlightenment. I know there's more out there. There's more out beyond the bounds of my five senses. I appreciate the many man-made schools of thought that try to pin down the unpin downable, the immensity, the Tao, the Supreme. I am happy to know I am happy not to know. I am happy to experience sudden moments of Satori. To brush up against something unexplainable that moves me. That wells up the waters within. To know there's more to life than me. To know there's more to life than us. Out there, beyond the boundaries of our five senses, there could be worlds within worlds, dreams within dreams, an everlasting Maya where the illusion is real and reality is just an illusion. Whether you believe in karma or destiny, it doesn't matter. Because one fact remains. We all have free will. Otherwise, there would be no point. Yogananda believes free will accounts for 25% of an incarnation. Even if my free will accounts for just 1% of power, I choose to use it wisely. I use my free will to improve my own life. I use my free will to uplift those around me. 
If you give me one chance, I'll take it. I treat this life as though it is one chance. I treat each day as though it is one day. I make it the best day I can. Because I know this day will never come again. I am a place of peace. I realize that on some level we are all connected and all is one. If I am peaceful today or being creative or having a good time then that is my contribution to the whole. It's a good contribution. I have no idea of the large-scale impact this contribution may have. Perhaps it's my piece that provides balance to a person who lives on my street or sits on another floor at work. Perhaps it's my piece that prevents a war from breaking out in another country. Though I cannot quantify the benefits of my life, I must know I'm important to the whole, or I wouldn't be here. Dear Jupiter, thank you for expanding my mind and expanding my heart. Thank you for propelling me to seek and search the truth. Thanks to this search, I have discovered the teachings of many brilliant minds. All this knowledge helps me get to know my own soul, to find out what's within me, that I'd either forgotten or deliberately chosen not to remember. I love playing this eternal game of hide and seek with you. And I look forward to more aha moments on the journey home. Thank you.